Indeed I could, but I'm right here behind this generator. That's it, Hedgehog. Stand there and be a nice little target. Tails, is that you humming? beam that runs on alien energy counts is doing something to him, does it? <laughs> to get to me, you're going to have to go through your best friend. <laughs> this turned out much better than I could have hoped, and I only used a small prototype. 
Enjoy it while you can. Oh, I will. In fact, the only way to make this better would be to have you two fight. Come on, Tails. Snap out of it, dude. You don't want to do this. <laughs> what the? Tails, buddy, are you all right? Huh? Where am I? Why is my nose hair tingling? Lousy, cheap alien energy. Huh? Ran out of juice. Well, I'll get more. Lots more. And then I won't just control one little punk, but the whole universe. In the meantime, enjoy the park. I'll leave you your own private tour guide. Pay up, Tails. I told you he had an evil plot, and coming here was a good idea. There it is, straight from the horse's mouth. Uh, we didn't bet. Dang. machine guns. So did you get any more info out of him? Well, it wasn't easy, but yeah. Well, we know Eggman is going to use the energy he's stealing for a mind control weapon. Learn that one the hard way. Do we know how Eggman is getting all these aliens? Yeah, yeah. At first I thought that Yacker was talking about how Baldy Nose Hair was using Burks to do it. Hmm, he is pretty gassy. Maybe the smell would knock him out? I don't know, something doesn't seem right with that. That's what I said. It made no sense. Then I made a tiny adjustment and realized he was saying generators. So, no burps. Well, that's a relief. Tell me about it. So basically, Eggman is using five tractor beam generators to hold their planet in orbit while he scoops the aliens all up. Hold a whole planet? Well, it's tiny, but still, yeah. Okay, fine. Five generators? Well, I've already leveled two. So, if my math is correct, that leaves us three more of those bad boys to take out. 
nobody said there'd be math, but I'm with you, buddy. We should get moving. Yakker says the aliens don't have much time. Once I start moving, I don't need much time. <laughs> Control weapon will be full of energy I've siphoned from the aliens, and Sonic's world will be the center of my interplanetary theme park. Y'all reckon you'll be able to get yourself enough of that energy to take over the whole dang planet? Yes, I reckon I will. Where is your new voice chip? Got it right here, sir. Just need to install it. The thick bones connected to the Talk bone. The talk bone's connected to the mouth bone. There. Good as new. Finally. I don't think anything could have been more annoying than that cowboy chatter. <laughs> Feeling ship shape with me new voice chip I am. I'm uh, begging your pardon, Squire. But me and they may think you're gonna sail off and search for that lover Sonic. Arr! Yeah. I think that's the wrong chip. Really? Are you sure he doesn't normally speak in pirate? On the right side, he's much more exotic now. Just go find him and fix that chip! <laughs> Shortly, I will have no need for those idiots. In just a few hours, Sonic's world will be under my control. When it is, it will be the crown jewel of my amusement park. The greatest amusement park in the universe! <laughs> I think I gloated so hard I pulled a muscle. Next stop, the Starlight Carnival. Next stop, Planet Wish. This attraction is currently off limits as it is still under construction and may not be dangerous enough for visitors yet. You know, as alien as this place is, there's something very Eggman-ish about it. I think he's transforming it somehow, making it part of his theme park. Attention guests, if you can hear this message, you are trespassing in an area still under renovation. If you are not a robot, please return to the main park areas and ignore anything evil you might have seen here. Thank you. It looks like the theme of his park is universal domination and the conquest of alien races. It's more than a theme, it's a reality. He's using them like some kind of living intergalactic gas. That's pretty low, even for a sleazeball like Eggman. Some displacement of indigenous aliens and destruction of natural resources may occur. Eggman Enterprise is not responsible. You getting any of that? Yeah, they're totally freaked out. It sounds like they're in shock because of public transportation and a loony nurse. Oh no, wait, scratch that. They're in shock because of their planet's strange transformation and having been dragged across the universe. Well, I still can't believe he kidnapped the whole planet. How does somebody do that? They're saying it was either ice cream or a tractor beam. Yeah, well, I'm going to guess it wasn't ice cream shooting out of those generators. If it was, I would get one for back home. Dude, I'd get two. Now, if everyone will excuse me, I'm going to put a stop to these renovations. the generator. It seems like these guys are getting harder and harder to find. I know for a fact these guys are getting harder and harder to beat. Please remember, all planets in Eggman's incredible interstellar amusement park are, as far as you know, wholly owned properties of Eggman Enterprises and its subsidiaries. All unauthorized photography, video reproduction, or shutting down of generators is strictly prohibited. Thank you! Eggman! I am going to save this planet, and I am going to free these aliens! No copyright law in the universe is going to stop me! We can save a lot of time and broken robots if you just quit now! Try to be reasonable.
myself. For a second there, I wasn't sure I was going to pull it off. Well, who am I kidding? We both knew how this would end. Uh, <laughs> are you talking to the broken robot who can't hear you? Uh, maybe. That's between me and the robot. See, the important thing here is the alien planet is free. Absolutely. So, we can just forget about the whole talking to dead robots thing, right? Nope. I knew you'd say that. <laughs> oh, come on. I've seen you save the day a lot of times, but I've never seen you talk to a pile of metal. Touché. Next stop, Planet Wind. This attraction is currently... Next stop, the Aquarium Park. This underwater attraction is the perfect place to commune with sea life and hopefully get you. Man, running past all those fish put me in the mood for sushi. I doubt Eggman had the decency to put a good sushi joint in this park. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, try the newest dining experience here at Eggman's incredible interstellar amusement park, the Bucket of Sushi. Now with fish. Ugh, like I was saying. Hey, did somebody here order a clobbering? Are you sure? It says somebody ordered an extra large clobbering topped with everything. Hmm, okay. Tell you what, I can't take this thing back, so I'll give you an extra large clobbering for nothing. Hope you're hungry.
Sonic. You know me. I aim to please. Well, I'm totally pleased. And a little nauseous. I grabbed a bite at the bucket of sushi. What's the verdict? His cruelty knows no bounds. Next stop, the Aquarium Park. Next stop, the Asteroid Coaster. Zoom along through and sometimes into space debris. Then lose your lunch in zero G.
What is this place? Whoa. This is where he converts them into the strange, negative aliens with the freaky energy. Oh, there you are. I thought I lost you for a second. Did you find anything interesting? Look at all of them. He's captured thousands of aliens. Don't worry. We'll get them out. Sonic? I haven't seen Yakker for a while. You'll have to excuse me, buddy. I have a generator to shut down.
something. All right, but uh, one that's, you know, less evil than this one. <laughs> <laughs> so, are all the aliens getting free? Looks like it. Once the power went off, the locks vanished. I hope Yakker's okay. I think you'll be fine. You don't think the weapon you were shot with still works? Not without power flowing to it. I think we're all good. That's what I like to hear. off any insane robots. True. Well, good job to you on inventing a translator that allowed us to speak to the aliens and figure out exactly what we needed to do so we weren't running around the park looking like idiots. <laughs> oh no, wait. That was me. Hmm. Good point. Either way, we can get out of this crazy place and go home. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like the aliens are happy to be going home too. Uh, I think we're in the middle of a party. The middle? We are the party. I think we're their guests of honor. Totally. Oh, ho, ho. that fool Sonic thinks he's won because he destroyed all my generators. Well, the mind control cannon is full enough for what it has to do. I will have the last laugh! The last laugh? How is laughing last special? Isn't that like being the slowest one to get the joke? Yeah, I laugh last all the time! People look at me like I'm an idiot, forget about it! That's because you are an idiot! Eh... Uh, hmm... <clears throat> you talking to me? Yes, I'm talking to you! There's nobody else here, so I must be talking to you! Why haven't we fixed your voice chip yet? Yo, quit busting my batteries over here! I've been working on it all day! What does that even mean? Oh, never mind! In a few seconds, it won't matter anyway, since the world will have only one thing on its mind! What's that, boss? <laughs> Me!
No! This can't be happening! It's backfiring! Impossible! How? Ta-da! Yo, what do you mean impossible? Your plans have been crushed by Sonic for like, eh, ever. He stopped you like it's his job or something. In fact, I can't remember a plan he didn't stop. What are you talking about? He hasn't stopped all of them. Name one. Um... Wait for the attention pad. Thank you, buddy! Hey, my voice! It's back! All right! Ah, there's the sweet sound by auditory processors new and love. Now I remember why we changed his voice chip. <laughs> no matter! I may have suffered a setback, but this thing's far from over! I will crush Sonic! <laughs>
I will destroy you, and I will be victorious! Is that better? Like a million times better. Thank you. This robot is special! He's powered by the energy from your little friends! He is invincible! So I'd say it's been nice knowing you, but it hasn't. I have to admit I'm a little scared. I don't think we can beat this guy. See you on the ground, buddy. Huh? Sonic, no! Just got one last thing to do! As for you...
okay? Man, I can't believe you made it through that. I like you thought I wouldn't. The only thing I was thinking about was getting pushed into an elevator. Well, a hedgehog's gotta do what a hedgehog's gotta do. Great job, Sonic. Thanks, but I had a little help during that last part. Saving us. Uh, he says you are welcome. That thing's translating pretty good. Yep, I finally got all the kinks out. We can talk to them perfectly now. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, great. He says goodbye, my friends. I have to go. <laughs> Just when I got this thing working. Better late than never, buddy. Yeah. 